Managing Connected Folders Now that you have connected some folders, let's take a moment to look at the options available. On the right side, you find Global Actions for the connected folders. The option to refresh the folder list updates the connected folders with the latest settings for when you know one of your teammates made significant changes. With Connect Folder, you can add more folders just like we covered in the last video. If you click the Sort option, you can change the order in which the list of folders is displayed. In the central area, you'll see all the connected folders that you can open or manage as needed. You may have noticed that some have more options than others. This happens because some options are only available to the person who connected the folder. The first option lets you add a tag to the folder to help you keep everything organized. To add a tag, click the button and enter some text. You can also pick a different color. Click Save when you're done. You can edit the tag or even remove it at any time by pressing the same button. The next one, the little lock, lets you set access permissions. By default, everyone can see and edit the folders you connect. You can change that here. Let's say that we want everyone to see the folder, but only one other colleague can edit. To do that, we need to set the global permission to Editing Restricted. Now click the text box and type the name of the person or group you want to have edit permission. Click the name and then click Add. The name now shows in the list. Click Apply to save and close the permissions window. In the context menu, you can find the option to open the folder in the original storage. You just need to click the option, and in a few moments, you'll see it on the storage's website. There's also the option to disconnect the folder in case you don't need it anymore in Confluence. Please keep in mind that this action is irreversible. If you attached files and folders from a connected folder and then disconnect it, all the attached files will be broken. Even if you connect the folder again, you'll need to attach the files and folders again. If you're sure you don't need it anymore, confirm your choice and the folder disappears from the list. This doesn't remove any files from your storage, it just breaks the link to team files. Only the person that connected a folder or an admin can disconnect a folder. On folders added by other users, you only have the option to open the folder in the original storage. In the following video, We'll look into what we can do with the connected folders in the file manager.